Hi there, Mayor Dan Pope with a weekly update. Hope you've had a great week. Um, so today happens to be Thursday, March the 2nd. It's the 181st birthday of our great state. Uh, 181 years ago today, 59 very brave Texans, without very much uh, de deliberation, declared our independence in Washington on the Brazos. At that very same time, the, the uh, Alamo was under siege, and y'all know the story better than I do, but uh, it, it should make us all proud. And what happened 181 years ago is still alive and well today. Great things are going on in the state of Texas. Great things are going on in Lubbock, and it's that fierce independent spirit that those patriots, those settlers had that still persists today in Lubbock, Texas. And it's one thing that makes Lubbock unique. And I want to celebrate that today, and I hope you do too. I've had a busy week um, the last couple of days doing ribbon cuttings and groundbreakings and a few of those kind of things. But I want to tell you about one visit I had yesterday to Wester Elementary. I went and visited with a bunch of second and third graders. And They've been studying government, and they had a few questions about government for me, and I talked a little bit about city government. But then they just did a wide open Q&A, and some of the questions I thought you would really enjoy. The, the question, one of the questions was asked is the same question that I get most asked from, from people, that my friends and, and associates, and they say, why did you run for mayor? Now, often they say it like, are you crazy? But the kids say it in a little different world. It's, it's real serious, why did you run for mayor? But I thought you might really like two questions that I got yesterday. The first one was, this young man said, Mr. Mayor, the president lives in the White House. Do you live in City Hall? And uh, I thought I got a good chuckle out of that. I thought it was a great question. And then as I was leaving, this one young, young boy came up and he tapped me on the leg and I leaned down and he goes, Mr. Mayor, do you drive around in one of those long cars? I said, no, I don't have a limousine. I drive myself around. But, you know, our, our kids are such an important part of our community, and that's truly one of the great parts of being mayor. Maybe my favorite part is just getting to uh, encourage them to spend time with them, whether they be elementary school kids or high schoolers, middle schoolers, or, or our, our college uh, students. I got a chance last week in Austin to be around some of the LCU leadership, spend a lot of time with the Tech Student Government Association. People are our greatest asset in this community of all ages. Uh, they, uh, they're a pleasure, you guys are all a pleasure to serve and, and I'm just thankful for each of you. I hope you have a great weekend. We appreciate your good ideas and, and uh, thoughts and prayers. Last week I got a great idea. Uh, somebody sent me to a website that, that I think uh, the city could learn something from. It came from the video. And so uh, those, those, are, uh, those, those things are all appreciated. Um, I hope you have a great weekend. Talk to you soon.